Okay, I'm going to show you guys how to do the install that Adrian Ambrosiak was making up. I had a little bit of issues with it, but I've since sorted out thanks to Adrian. He has a video out already, but it's a little over the top. It's all over the place, so I'm going to try to simplify one here real quick. So, first things first, you got to download the zip file. Here's the link. You go here, you download it, then you extract it to your directory of choice. It's extracted. Now, you have to change this little bit here at the bottom where it says desktop gala you gotta remove that and put in greeter instead this is the file you have to edit system background vala you can either do it in the command line I chose to do it just by navigating to it Positor, it's right here I've already done it it's right there exit out auto save now the other thing you gotta do is you gotta make an image and you gotta save it as a PNG file as texture.png so you save it into your data folder I've already got one in there to do that you use GIMP open up any file you want take one whatever make it your own and then you export it as texture dot png I put mine in the pictures folder and then I drag and dropped it into the data folder Okay, that part's done. Just a quick and easy bit. Now install the dependencies. That's really easy. Copy and paste all that. The issue I was having was right here. This libmutter2 dev. I was missing that little bit because it wasn't in the original post. It is now. Thank you, Adrian. Copy and paste all that. Put it into the terminal. Hit enter it'll run it I'm not going to do it again because I've already done it so then you go ahead and navigate over to the folder of where your greeter master folder is Okay, you run this command right here. Copy and paste it, put it into your terminal, hit enter, boom, it'll be done. Then you navigate over to your build folder and run Ninja. I've already done it. Quick and easy. You reboot your system and then your background image that you made called texture.png that you put into your data folder will be now on your lock screen. And that's it folks. It's super simple, super